Hello, Viola Engineering. This is Drew Forte. I am your benefits consultant, and Barb asked me to walk you all through the online enrollment platform. So we are creating this tutorial video uh, just to show you how you can set up your medical and dental benefits for 2017. Um, this video should last about 10 minutes or so. I want to explain the different plans to you all and, and just walk you through your options. Okay, so let's just get right to it. Uh, you're going to go to this website right here, glandedinsurance.easyappsonline.com. And when you come to that, you're going to get to this page, or, or one that looks very similar. You're going to hit first time user. From there, you type in your last name, year of birth, month of birth, click find me. Everybody has been loaded into the system already. Um, it may bring you to a little bit different prompt where you'll enter in your basic information, but it is, it's very straightforward. I had already done that. Um, so it brings me here. I could click it to get an email password. I'm going to go back here, enter my username and password. Okay. Once you do log in, it's going to ask you for a security question. It gives you about eight or nine different questions you could choose from. I chose city of birth. You enter that in there. Okay, once you do log in, it's going to bring you to this landing page. It has the Viola Engineering logo. It has all of my information here, contact info. If you have any questions, you can contact me anytime. Um, that's my job is to help you all through this process and throughout the year if you have any you know, needs that have to do with the health, dental, life insurance benefits. Um, so then you're going to click on this modify my benefits. Okay. And it'll actually say, yours will say apply for benefits and it'll bring you that page. You click agree and you enter in your basic information. It's just all data entry, uh, in, in, entry right at this point. Um, so enter your name, social, date of birth, marital status, if you, do, if you are married, it will ask for your anniversary. Um, your gender, tobacco, everybody can answer no just because there are no price differences anymore with health insurance when it comes to tobacco users. Once you finish that section, you click continue to demographics. Continue entering in your info for your home address. Um, then enter your best contact information, whether it's a cell phone, a home landline, and then continue on, enter the, the best email contact info for you as well, where, you know, Anthem and any of the medical companies will send information to you if, if you know, there's claims info or, or something else that's needed. All right, we continue on to contact, I continue the job info where you enter in your, your position with Viola Engineering, your hire date, full-time, um, if you're full-time, part-time employee, how many hours you work per week, and then how your income is reported. So most likely, I can believe everybody's a W-2 employee, so you enter that. If for some reason at any point you don't know an answer to anything, let's just say your hire date, you can always save an exit, and then you could contact Barb for that information. Um, or you could contact me, because Barb has sent that to me as well. Um, so continue on to your benefits. All right, so then at this point, you're going you're gonna to check off the boxes of, of what you want to find out pricing for. So in this case, we'll, we'll just check off medical and dental. Hit continue. It will bring you to another page. If you have dependents, at that point, you can add dependents, and you type in their basic information. It would just bring you to a simple page like this. You enter their name, social, date of birth, et cetera. Um, if you are trying to sign up your dependents for health and dental, or just say one of those two options, you check off the appropriate boxes and hit continue. Okay, now it's gonna bring you to the plan selection page. Um, on here, I'm gonna point out a couple key pieces. We are offering three different health insurance plans. I will walk you through each of those in a moment. And then we also offer, are offering a dental plan through Companion Life. We are switching dental providers this year because we were able to offer the exact same benefits but save you all about 10 to 15% in costs 
uh, by switching providers. All right, so you will see the pricing for just the employee only on a biweekly basis or employee child. In my case, I added on a child for, you know, just to have a dependent as an example. Um, so it will give the biweekly prices for each plan. It will give you the, the prices for the dental plans as well. From there, you'll also see this little piece of paper. If you click on that paper, piece of paper, it will load up the summary of benefits in a new page, and you can go through each of the plans to see what plan may be best for you and your family. Um, so all of those right there at your fingertips, you just click on it. You can see what co-pays are, what, how prescriptions would be covered, what are the deductibles, et cetera. Um, but I will give you a quick walkthrough of each of them right now. Um, so plan one here is, is kind of the Cadillac option of all the plans. It is a PPO plan, uh, which has the largest doctor's network, has the lowest deductible of the plans we're offering at $500. Um, it does have co-pays, has pres great prescription benefits. This plan is definitely tailored more towards, um, you know, the, maybe the older employees, employees who may have some medical issues or expensive prescriptions. Um, they're going to want to probably choose plan one. And on plan one, Viola, the company is going to cover 50% of the employee's cost, and they will not cover anything for your dependent cost. All right, plan number two is a POS plan, which stands for point of service. And it is a plan that you're captive as far as your in-network benefits are captive to the state of Virginia. Um, so it's part of the Health Keepers Network, which is a HMO network. So much smaller network than the PPO plans. Um, but you do have limited out-of-network benefits where you, are, uh, you have access to going out of state. Um, so if you had to go to Johns Hopkins or go somewhere, you could. Um, so it's just at a much higher deductible level. Um, then you have plan number three, the, the Anthem 2600 Silver PPO. That is a health savings account plan. That plan is designed um, for maybe the younger family, um, somebody or single healthy person who doesn't go to the doctors often. This plan does not have co-pays, does not have prescription benefits. Um, but it is, you know, you pay dollar for dollar retail cost, um, and it all goes towards your deductible. So if there's a prescription that's fifty dollars uh, a month, you would pay the fifty dollars, and it all goes towards your de your deductible. Um, if a doctor's visit costs two hundred dollars, you would pay two hundred, and it would all go towards your deductible. Um, so again, that one is is probably tailored more towards the the young healthy person um, who doesn't go to the doctors that often. Finally, the dental plan here, um, that one is through Companion Life. You'll see it has uh, a $50 deductible for your basic and major services. And preventive care, your two exams every, every year at cleanings are free. Um, and then your basic services are covered at 80%. Major services are 50-50 between you and the insurance company. So once you decide what plans you want to choose, you just hit the select button, and then you hit continue. Okay. Next, it just brings you to the, the following page, confirming the, the pricing um, and what plan selections you wanted to make. At this point, if you really want to download any of the summary benefits for, benefits for your records, you could do so. You hit continue again. This just brings you to your personal data. They want to make sure all of your information is accurate. So it gives you one more chance to review your address and other information. And then also review this section. It's very important, your enrollment data to make sure you enroll you or your dependents on the proper plan. So it should say yes if you want to enroll in the plan. Okay. Finally, you just have to click these review terms. So these are just the end of the application saying, you know, that you are telling the truth, you're not trying to commit fraud. Um, with all the questions you've answered, you check the two boxes off, you hit I agree. And from there, you do a, it's a little bit difficult, but you do a digital signature here. 
and then you say I agree and approve the completion of this form electronically and applications completed you'll get a yellow bar across the top here and everything is correct so just confirm again that the correct plan options were were selected um, at that point if you have any other questions please contact me um, and and again if you have questions regarding the plans or trying to figure out what plans best for you and your family my number is at the top of every screen you can reach out to me um, and I will get back to you if I'm not available I'll get back to you as soon as possible and, and help you all enroll um, so again I, I appreciate I uh, appreciate working with Viola Engineering, and I, I hope to, to meet all of you very soon. Thanks so much. Bye-bye.